Oh, we have another Wood Elf game, so it's a Wood Elf Mirror. Oh, that's quite high. Hmm. That's a Wood Elf team with actual players. Uh, one, two, three. Oh, he's only got 11. Petty cash, 350. Right, we'll have one of those. One of those. Hmm. Let's do that. Yeah, I've, I've already got a decent mic. You should get some military grade 3D headset. You never know when you're going to need to pull. Uh, <laughs> well, maybe I'll lip on, yes. I am, um, yes, got a new headset. Uh, sorry, a new mic. New desk mic. If it wouldn't mess everything up. Um, your voice is a bit scratchy. Hmm. I, it's bizarre because I did a, um, I did a, 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 a sound check yesterday when the head, when it came, came in and just hit record on OBS and then played like, a minute of me talking at different volumes and different pitches and different angles and all that sort of stuff that you do and it seemed fine so all I want is a comfortable set of headphones because one thing that the um, the A50 was it was bloody comfortable uh, receive the ball please So if you're okay, the sound is okay. Yes, I'm fine. Thank you very much. Buzz, we shall continue. One thing I'm not a fan of is that the... I wonder what happened... Hang on. Is the microphone is in the way of the keyboard. So let's just put the mic there. You guys tell me if that's actually made things better or worse for the sound quality. Because now I can use the keyboard. It sounds echoey. Talk more. Um, that sort of mic should be six, six. Oh. I'll put it back. There we go. It's not better. Lucky a crook can't cope with wood elf, wood elf. Yeah, fair enough. You should invest. Well, we are we are going to move house this year. This year, by the way, so you never know. That's a fucking war dancer, isn't it? Jesus Christ! If you could pick skills on a war dancer, I would probably pick those skills. He's got a very nice team, hasn't he? Uh, right. So we've got two rookie catches. Um, and just swap that round. Oh, you've left me a dauntless. Oh, I haven't got a guard player because he fucking died um, a quick snap here would be hilarious 
And we'll run the ball on you then. So. What do we need? Um, one, two, three, four, five. So I need two assists. One, one, two, three, four, five, six. So go there. You dodge off and go there. You blitz through. Surferino happens. That looks alright to me. Do I need you to be there? No, so let's not let's not add a dice roll dodge that I need to add in. Because I can't throw blocks against that. Um, where's the dirty player? You swine. You need to be there. So no foul turn one, but we will be going at it. Um That'll do. Yes, DP lineman. I know. Very, the very first thing is go fetch the ball and make that safe, isn't it? It just is. Um, where can you get to there? So you need to go there. Um, is there anything we're going to have to hit remotely well? I c oh, well, it's, it's the same as a blitz or something annoying, isn't it? How many fouls can we get in? If we commit like a motherfucker, what happens? Let's have you there. No foul this time. Well, that was a f not a t not a good start, was it? The HyperX headset, Nasha. Thank you very much. I'll write that one down. Um, does Pitch Invasion roll against Dolman? No, it's a, a fan factor based um, uh, action. Um, buzz. So, whoever's got, it's D6, and if you roll a 6 or a 1, it doesn't matter which way around it is, um, you get knocked over. Um, however, if you also add the fame roll to it, so um, he's plus uh, 1 on fame, I think. Yeah, plus 1. So he, he knocks me over on a 5 or a 6. I knock him over on a six. So we got three down. He got one, two, three, four, five, six down. So. Um, I wonder if there's been a case of... Um, Probably, but very unlikely, Donkey Dragon, because you can't both have fame. So one of the teams would have had to roll 11 sixes in a row. Um, I don't know. 
what 11 sixes in a row is, um, other than not very likely. It was more irritating that he left a player for me to surf and didn't get punished for it. Eh, yeah, whatever. How fucking annoying is it to be pitching raging on tabletop? Um, it takes a little bit of time. That's that is that is true. Right, so we've got a block there, which is a fucking horrible block. One, two, three, four. So we can foul from there. So if I put him in that square, he is foulable. So, um, first thing to do is this. <gasps> Weirdly, it blitz with a ball carrier. Let's see whether you knock him over. Now, do I need to make him a screen piece? How many players have I got left? So you can come back there. So actually, let's put the ball carrier War dancer, war dancer. Dirty player can go there. Play a little bit fast and loose with this. Just a little bit. You will be going there. That's one of them out. <sighs> um, Donkey Dragon, why cage up next to his war answer? Basically that. Um, Dice-wise, we needed to avoid a one in nine on a loner, and I needed to avoid uh, a two plus when dodging out. So, yeah, there was a failure in there. There was failure, absolutely. Um, it was not likely to go wrong. Cheers, Zug. Thank you very much. It feels like he's going to come and attack us. Yeah, he's going to come in and get us. I think this is a bit, this is a bit, if it works, it's genius, if it, but it's not likely to work. That was a five plus. 
uh, there because the catchy's got the most chance of catching it. Uh, for the knockdown, more playback. I don't care the ball going on the floor. He's got no ball recovery. So if he'd have rolled a push, I sidestep here, and it's in one of these eight squares. Don't care. Um, in fact, I want him to attack me because in the next turn, we can knock this over and foul it. Take that off the field. Half done. So he got the top end of of the expectation there. Of what you you could realistically expect to get. He has very much pushed his luck and been paid for it I guess Very first thing to do is block that over. No follow. Let's see where the ball goes. Ah, perfect. <laughs> Roll a pal. That's just as good. And now it's a case of just trying to free up some players so the dirty player can dodge out and kill that. there you throw this block fine no, that's disappointing now the dirty player is not gonna have to one in nine his way out I'll leave that based we can go on in. Go and stand near that. Hopefully we uh, stun this or better. That was better. That is the perfect, perfect one. Oh, he's back. Because MN MNG was just the right roll because um, it was possibly not worth apothecarying, but at the same time, um, wasn't a serious injury, which would be an auto apothecary. Dodge away here. Dodge away there. Go and stand around the back. How many turns we got? Three. I'm going to leave you there.
<sighs> DP doing work. Yeah, he's he's knocked out and removed both war dancers, hasn't he? So um, that war dancer's not coming back on four plus. Um, that war dancer is coming back. So the next target we need to deal with uh, is that one. However, now the Apothecary's gone, it's stand and foul on anything because um, they're, all, they're all value targets now. Foul the tree. What's he actually got on that tree? Has he got a niggle? Oh, it's got a niggle. That's not insane. That's actually not an insane idea. Not yet, but it's not an insane idea. Loving bash woodies. Um, remember the miner? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's what I mean. It's it's not an insane idea yet. It would I do it? Yes. Will I do it now? No. But I will. I will. He really misplayed. It, he was very aggressive. Yeah. Forget everything else. Foul the tree. <laughs> what turn are we on? Four. Hmm. Right. Well, that's that. It's that. It's foul that next turn. Because we can get. Quite a few assists in. Have you stood up? No. Let's have you forward and get out of the way so you're over there. Blitz. Now he is kind of, well he's not even kind of, he is now out of tackle. Um, so I could go, you can go there, walk you in and dodge. Ball carrier steps forward a square. Now, that's now another one of his good players going to get crunched on. The only thing I don't want is I don't want the dirty player hitting. He's in the way. You there. Three plus foul. So basically, it's a seven plus injury or a seven plus removal. Oh, double two, double one. Unbelievable, Jeff. So we know we need some yardage. He knows we need some yardage. Let's go and have some yardage. Let's see what happens. Uh, do we get? Yeah, it was. Um, <laughs> we went for two bribes, Baz, um, and a DP. I was like, wizard. Nah, fuck that. Never realised how. Yeah. Yes, Vico, I would too. Hey. 
the bribe going now does mean that um, there are only now we're, there's two different ways now I can play this out we can either play um, now back to high value targets so there are three high value targets on his team uh, that's the tree the catcher and the award answer that's in the reserves box all three are fine just pick it's like pick one um, or um, I can carry on fouling and go for um, uh, you yeah, basically it's like do I use the bribe maybe then do I um, then have to stop Who cares about the tree? It's only because it's got grab, and it will mean that one turning with him, with the tree for him, is very easy. His one turning should be very, very easy. Well, you shouldn't leave that lying around. That was just careless. We are going to foul this. One, two, hang on. Where can you get to there? That was careless. You shouldn't be leaving that line around. If you want a five plus dodge through to a one dice, you can have it. But really, really, we should be okay. Straight injury roll. Oh, that's going to chafe. It was a straight injury roll. So that makes him one turning. That makes the one turner harder. Um, but let's just remember what this player is capable of. And he's still got the combo of the tree and this player. So movement eight with grab is kind of similar to what movement eight with sidestep. So uh, that's three pushes. And the first push you should generate. So you only need two more. <laughs> yes, Miss Shaps, pretty much. Because it is. Um, it's important that he knows what he's getting himself into. 
timber. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, Carlos, welcome to the show. You join us at a particularly tense time. Um, Dina Reno will contact you shortly with a short questionnaire. Um, we'd like to know all about our viewers. But I think I think if this was me, what I'd what I'd be looking at trying to do here now. Um, well, what I would have done was protected this guy. I'd have, I'd have shut, shut up shop and I'd just gone for the one turn. Um, because being so many players down now, you aren't going to stop me. Questionnaire. Um, yeah, playback. It's, it's, a, it's a running joke. Um, that um, we, uh, we like to know a lot about the viewers. Because it makes the, the show more interactive. I wouldn't be surprised if it takes them both down here. Yep. Oh, now that tree is fucking tempting. I'm not going to lie. That That is super tempting. It's the wrong play, but it is super tempting. It's the wrong play because you can't get enough assists on it. It's not the wrong play because it's not... Because it, it's the wrong play. Um... No, let's go. Let's go and put ourselves in scoring range. So, we'll blitz that one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I was about to say it might not get up, but of course it is going to get up because. Um, They've all got, uh, it's got movement three, hasn't it? So, right, be careful not to overextend. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, Chicala, thank you very much for the host. Much appreciated, sir. Did you have a good stream? Uh oh. Uh, some stuff in here without dodge, so. Bring the frenzy over because that's useful. Catcher goes over here. This is uh, a little bit naughty. There we go. I was a little bit naughty, but in the end, all right. You won turn 16. Congratulations. Uh, what were you playing in, Chicola? Think about the niggle, says Animal. Uh, I'm saving the dirty player for that movement, uh, the Agility 5 Ward answer. Because if we get that on the floor, we are we are stamping on it. What was it in? Uh, CCL? Because the, the, uh, the, the right thing to do here now is to try and kill, kill damage the, uh, the, the Agility 5 nasty Ward answer. Okay. And you're playing Dwarves. You might be able to do a half-decent job of screening this, you know. 
one, two. So he can go. Let's say he puts one there. One there. Two there. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we just need to be on point. We need to be level with where my catcher is now. Hey. Feed him and food. I'm in the wrong home tomorrow, aren't I? Sorry? I'm not home tomorrow. Do you want no. me now? Yes. Um, that's, uh, not I really. Just, okay, that's fine. No, I just checked. I mean, I, I, I would probably eat something if you knocked something off. Just a little, just a little I'm, something. I'm going to have like a jam on toast or something. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, like a, yeah. Yeah, like Come, a yeah, just a couple of things on toast, that'd be quite nice. Yeah. Cream mm. cheese on toast. Yeah. Or like yeah. Um, all right. This season, Champ is not that desperately important. Oh, and he's gone and put him on the floor again. Can the tackle get over? Um, one, two, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, he's done a better job than he should have been allowed to, I think. Remember you have a mic? Yeah, I know. I'm not... I wouldn't make any secret of it. This, this season of Champ Life is not as important as last one. This is a bit naughty, this. But got him down. Um, no, it's the two minute turns. I don't think it's anywhere near as fun. For me, taking a bit of the, I don't know, the skill out of it. But it's just my personal opinion. I am allowed to have one. It is a personal opinion. It is not wrong. It is not right. It's just, just what it is. Um, one, two, three, four. Do you want to score on that catcher? That's not bad clicking, isn't it? Big Burly Bob says he's played 100 games in Skaven. Um, yeah. When are the um, Rebel Divisions coming out next? Because the Rebel's in its quarter-final, semi-final type time, isn't it? So when's the next? when's the next division?
that I'm looking forward to. Couple of weeks, fair enough. More playback says Sada quick level tactics. Uh, it's time, really. Uh, Yeti's no Yeti. It's not. Not even close. Not even. Not even close. It's. It, I mean, it is good. Um, but it's, nah. March 31st, fair enough. the points I suppose what was the best one? Oh, it was one in blood back in blood bowl one um, and we had a mighty blow piling on uh, blitzer who also had guard the team had six players with guard in general um, we had an agility four, strength five witch elf I had a well I went through three witch elves one had mighty blow one had agility five um, and then I had that one as well. Uh, the thrower had 76 star player points of skills. Strong arm, accurate, pass, dodge, sure hands, I think. Um, agility 5. Strength 4, agility 5. Um, it was just, just like... If if any of you guys watched this, this the game where I played against Zunk, um, where we made a custom team... It was like, it wasn't very far away from, what sort of custom team would you like? Um, you still haven't signed for Rebel. I didn't know we needed to yet. There's lots of things I still haven't done, to be fair. Signing up for Rebel is just one of them. Uh, well, I suppose it's blitz that really, isn't it? Can he score? No, just checking. Rebel.net sign up. Do you want to post a link, Thomas? You'd probably pick up a whole bunch of other sign ups then. So he's going to grab a tree. That's what he's going to do, isn't it? He's going to use 
he can grab I don't think this defense is very good you know it looks shit hmm Thanks, Thomas. I'll click that. Thank you. Um, more playback says he only started. Is this the one? Mm -mm. It, it, mm. It's a tricky one, Mike, for me. This this setup because um, because of the uh, the tree with the grab. So I like the idea that it's got spaces in it, um, but that's about as much as I like out of it. Um, it's important to guard the squares behind the players, but he's going to go grab, one turner goes in that square there, block sideways, that gets you your first push. You've still got your blitz at this point, which you've then moved this guy out of the way, so... If you follow and follow, you can blitz and you can get your second push and you're in range. So it is a thing. I've just never seen it before. Um, you've already signed up. Good. If you guys, by the way, if there's anyone in chat who hasn't signed up to um, to Rebel and you are looking for what is basically the best, best private league in Blood Bowl 2... Of which there are more than one. Um, it's certainly the biggest. It's got a lot going for it. Um, let me also speak highly of BB Tactics and OCC. Sign up to Rebel. A big guy was asking if playing Wood Elves for the first time in Rebel. What, me? No, I'm playing Dark Elves. But not of UK Rebel. Oh, you could mention the UK Rebel. I guess the point, uh, Artemis, would be there's many, many leagues out there. Um, pick whichever is your favourite. Hey. the one turn there so you go on the diagonal Pepsi is oh well that's canned him G-Man is mostly EU Marmite um, and Pepsi on a toast. Um, Professor, um, the thing about Rebel is that it's got three different um, region spe spe specific leagues. So you've got um, the REL, which is, as Thomas has said there, which is all American uh, time zone people. And so they group you all together uh, and let you play together. Um, and then if there's the, then there's the people who play um, in like Australia and, and stuff. There's the third third one, which is the whatever it's called. Oh, you want advice to what to join Rebel with? Oh blimey! Um, whatever you feel comfortable with. He's the one asking if Woody's is okay to play with. Um, 
Oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, they are. Are Wood Elves okay to play with? Oh, absolutely. The 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 question with Wood Elves is you. Um, Sage plays Wood Elves in OCC, and um, the thing that you've got to bear in mind is that the OC the Wood Elves themselves you'll you'll end up playing with like six players a load of the times. So if you're prepared to mentally go through that, which is a load of times, you're not going to have a full team. Um, then they're great. But you've got to be mentally prepared for that. Um, hmm. Where's that? Yeah, he's still got that on the field. Blah. So, I'm currently thinking about how to keep the two one answers and the two catches safe uh, in inverted commas, and I think. The only way to do that, actually, is to use the shit smiley face defence. Um, and it's not normally shit, it's just shit in this circumstance. Because you're giving up the sideline. Which is no good. No good. No good. Oh well. If I'm here, my two turn. Yes, I two turn here as well. Which is why I don't want to give up the sideline. Um. But I suspect what he's going to do, he'll try and grind. Because most players would, cry, would grind in this situation. Bad, but not devastating. Because we could have lost more. That That's fairly even, considering he's got fame. Yeah, Re Rebel, if you're not... If you're not prepared to, to, to play through what could well be l literally 10 more games of shite, um, don't play AV7. Because Rebel, the seasons are really long. 
I like the fact that the seasons are long, but it doesn't do you any favours if things are going wrong. Oh, we bench the DP again. Oh, you. Uh, AB9 will let you do, make you have bad habits though sometimes, Bob. It's more forgiving for sure, but it lets you have bad habits. Uh, dodge, chub step. Good night, Wee Wah. Thanks for popping by. the game here. So with three players down and that one being available, that's actually the blitz. Consolidate. Looks like a weird blitz, but it is the blitz. It just is. Good, Pepsi's knocked out again. Then we get our three knockouts, uh, uh, stun players back. Um, he's then only grouped up in a corner, which is not the right place to be. Um, oh. Oh. Come on. Oh. Just don't want in fucking nine. <sighs> Fuck off. Oh, you only needed the push. Interesting to see where he goes next. Probably just goes and stands next to the tree. Maybe seven holding. Oh, the tree's rooted again. Uh, yes, he managed to one turn, sadly. Um, <laughs> hello, Pike. Uh, where are you staying at the moment, Pike? Uh, what's the right number of catches for these once you finish your lineup? Three or four? It, you can you can viably have all four. 
Um, it, it is just unlikely that you'll ever get to having all four. Oh, because as they, someone just said, they die. A lot. Um, oh, you've got home. Fantastic. So, that's an annoying player to have l lurking around. Tree's got guard. One, two. two. Stand you up. you there. One, two, three, four. No, you can't go there. You can go there. Oh, Pike, thank you very much. <laughs> Welcome back. Uh, you do need to go there. This then means he can't go anywhere near his tree. is looking very exposed, isn't it? Let's have you over there. Let's, I, I really don't want him running over here. Next turn with a turn will be strike. Next turn will define what, what the result of this game is, possibly. Hello, Zorgar. How you doing, sir? Rusty's here. Quick, act tough. Who's Rusty? Oh, Rusty. Welcome to the uh, welcome to the show. So now he can dodge this guy out on the two. Uh, what I don't think he's going to be able to do is fully screen the cage all round. Von Steinberg is injured. Won't be playing that game. That's where the ball's going then. Have I got a new haircut? No, it's just without a headset on. Interesting to see what happens next turn. Uh, when's Zunk getting on day shifts? I don't think Zunk wants to get on day shifts, to be honest. I think I think Zunk is completely fine not being on day shift. Because it fits in with his own personal lifestyle where he gets up at late in the afternoon or late in the Late in the morning, goes to bed late in the evening. He won't change. Hey. 
Well, this is the turn. This is the turn to strike. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we need to go and leap in from there. So we will we will be leaping with this guy from there. Um, in fact, arguably, we need to leap in with this guy, don't we? Because um, sidestep. Oh, every other player you move now, every other player you move um, is a player less. One, two, three, four, five. Every other player you move is a player less for um, making the ball safe afterwards. He says as he carries on moving loads of players around. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. be fair I can put these players in so, so if I can bl blitz leap from there on the floor do I follow this up yes because it makes another tackle zone on someone oh shit So two L behind because when he tries to knock me over. We might get surfed here. This feels very surfable, doesn't it? Well, I think, I think for me, I think I'd take the free two dice. Yeah. Stay on the pitch, stay on the pitch, stay on the pitch, stay on the pitch. Oh. Not as good as I wanted, not as bad as it could have been. Um, well, you say that, look at this war dance, look at the range that that war dance has got, and it's edge five. So anywhere where the ball goes, he can just go boink and away. Um, my war dancers, are closer to the side so we can range my war dancers with his war dancer so i think i think you would what he's got to decide now is does he go two dice here bounce onto the ball and play lot lotteries of where the ball might go Oh, okay, so he's going to go and blitz, and then two plus pick up the ball. Fair enough. If only I had blitz with a sidestep. Um, well, he's not. He, isn't, he hasn't touched him. The catcher that got knocked over was was the problem. The 
the good news for me here is now um, that he can't range my war dancers with his ones. So that's one, that's two. And that's three back to there. Casual double one. scores oh well two very frustrating games of football this evening That is true. More playback, that is true. Mm -hmm. Where's the couch at? So, I've got choice. One casualty, that's shit, isn't it? Um, Go and score in two, and we see if we can win the game. That's what I think I'm going to go and try and do. Yep, I think we'll do that. I think we'll try and win the game. Score in two, which means you need to go and stand there. And you can stand there. Don't forget to set off the pitch invasion, yeah. never really found it um, would be great if each team had something uh, I've never really found a uh, a theme for my blood bowl So I want to go throw from somewhere relevant without leaving it. So there. Hang on a second. I don't want to throw from there. Because that fucker will come along and steal it. Gonna try and strip ball. This is an awful, awful location for the ball carrier to be in, actually. So 
and you will end up being here. He will he will attack. Yeah, we've got the the, the DP. Oh. I say he'll attack and then he doesn't. Fair enough. Hmm. Don't like that ward answer. Don't like that ward answer at all. If only we had a player with guard. Or a movement 10 player. Or something else. So this is just kind of go score. I think on defense. I think we stop him on defense. <laughs> it has true mishaps yet. But it's um, it was it was all about. <laughs> yeah, I didn't follow tree. It was. It was all about the one turn. If he doesn't make the one turn, you know, we we drew a game earlier today because we missed our one turn. Um, I drew against uh, Kayfode yesterday because he made his one turn. Um, at the moment, we m keep missing ours and the opponent keeps making theirs. <laughs> Which is annoying. Oh, yes, I would. Yes, I would consider pass block on a uh, on a doofus. Right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight. I'm sure that's I'm sure that's eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, okay, that's eight. Um, in that case. Let's try and blitz that down. It's almost the same odds as... A pal on... Two dice. Four dice needing a pal. It's not a million miles worse than two dice needing a pal or a stumbles. Cheese toasty. Nasha, we had one earlier. Um, Chubman's not a fan of melted cheese. What? What? Has he got his knockout back again? Or was that mine? I didn't see whose knockout came back. Was that my knockout returning or was that his? Uh, so it's 10 plays 11. That was mine. Right, okay.
<sighs> uh, so I, I've still got 11 because I bought a loner. Uh, he's got 10. You've got to assume that this turn, this time round, he'll do stuff differently. Let's see how he runs. So, I don't want to attack. I don't want to attack where the. Um, where the tree is. Mm, perfect defense is not terrible here. Does mean I can do that. Still fairly trivial to get some two dice blocks off. That puts some pressure in. So what would happen now if if he took the ball, bounces the ball, ignores these, hands it off, and fucks off? Where can you get to? Far enough to be annoying. And I'd only have a handful of players to respond. And you're going to blitz that one down or that one down. In that case, let's have you there. Done. No, there's no, there's no point leaving the tree a free hit because the tree now has got to move. He's got to do something. <coughs> so he's got to roll a, he's got to roll a, um, a dice to move, and he might have rooted. And if he roots, happy days. My poor dirty player. I want to see what he does with the ball. Because looking at that positioning there you can see the opening positioning is suggesting the X. So you're suggesting that that's, that's where the ball's going. That's quite aggressive. Level up his war dancer. Which one? Oh, is this one already leveled? Yeah, that one's leveled. That one miles away. I, I'm, I'm really intrigued to see what he does with the ball. He's obviously got a plan because he's he's clicking stuff in a, in a. He's obviously put he's worked out where the ball's going. I'm not entirely sure where he's putting the ball. Have you guys worked it out? I don't know. You think he'll he'll you think he'll range it? He might. It's where that it's where his other war dancer goes, which is the important question. Oh, that's an annoying square. <gasps> well. says but I assume it's some form of for fuck's sake 
Um, unfortunately, with two minute turns, I don't have time to uh, commentate or comment. That was very unlucky. I've had more opportunities this turn, this half, um, for for nonsense to happen to me. Let's make this three dice, because fuck me, we need it. We need it. So this takes it from fifty-five to seventy-five percent. Uh, likely to knock down. We will be following that up. And now we can pick it up. Wardance has got tackle. Ugh. So that Wardance has actually got tackle. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Go for it with a ball carrier. What can possibly go wrong? And now my turn for some shit luck. Oh well. <sighs> so pretty pretty sure he can do stuff. Uh two died to block, yeah it probably was actually. Um, but I would have carried on dodging stuff. I was hoping to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I'd had someone there and someone there. Oh well. <laughs> oh well. Um, the, the thing that will that is good is that we've still got the ball on the side stepper. Oh, strip. Uh, I think you go there. Because anywhere in those four squares, is, anywhere them three squares is horrendous for him. And anywhere there, you know, there's also bad. So there was lots of bad squares. There, I've got no idea what's going to happen. And it could have gone bobble, 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 gone. Yeah, bobble onto him, bobble into there. GG. It's a close game. We'll see where we'll see what happens next. So three plus dodge, no dodge. That's the team reroll gone. Four plus pickup, four plus dodge. Casual.
Two plus dodge, no dodge. And can't really get anywhere. Didn't like that plate, not gonna lie. I really want to score on 16. So I score on 15. And he one turns me. We are 3 3. Three. I just don't think I, I don't think I can do it, I think. Unless both war dancers get stunned. That's one. Saying that, actually, um, Blitz, I need to run over and kick it in the face, if this is a knockdown. If this is a knockdown. Oh, I don't need to kick it in the face, it's down. In that case, it's kicked that in the head. Stunned, stunned, stunned. Can't get me. Where can you get to? Yeah, you're looking at two red dice uphill now, aren't you? So two dice uphill a pal. Nah. Well, well, who's a lucky Andy? Absolutely. <laughs> fucking loners still can't dodge. Oh well. Who's a lucky Andy? Absolutely. Unless, of course, he now dodges out, two dice up hills, um, rolls are basically a double pal. Well, not basically. Rolls the double pal. Um, knocks it into the crowd. The ball goes long. And um, we have one of the most unlikely turns of blood bowl that you're ever going to see. Do I want to use tackle? Uh, very much want to use tackle. Oh, nearly. If he had tackle. I don't want to dodge, yeah. Uh, this will be... 13-2-1 Dionysian. Something like that. But it is Wood Elves, so... It, it's not like it's super challenging to get 
a decent record most of the time. I, I think Woody's are one of the best. Uh, now he's got sidestep. I think Woody's are one of the best teams in Champ Ladder. For, for Champion Ladder specifically. Um, one of the best teams, period. That is true. Hello, food. You swine stealing points off me yesterday. Or Sunday when it was. Sunday. That fucking one turn. Ugh. Ugh. You did actually, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's true. Um, let's go for that, isn't it? That's actually the right play. So that's 70% likely to happen. That's 2% likely to happen. It's that. Bar triple skull and double one, we're in. Uh, they are mutually exclusive. Roll less dice, it's a good mantra, isn't it? Dodge score. GG. Um, I'd like. Uh, he, he didn't. It, that one wasn't the side step one. Less dice, fewer dice. Yes. Why is it not less dice? I understand that it is wrong, but why is it wrong? Uh, bad things. It would have gone to the end of the game. And turns down a surf proudly. Thanks very much. Yay! No. 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 Uh, oh, Catcher gets an MVP. That's good. So, um, pretty crappy star player points, but we got the win. Which wasn't looking likely at some points. So, I'd like a big fat move increase, please. Oh well. Um, record for this lot now. Uh, they've managed to play 16 games and still look completely shit. Um, I think that's an impressive. Um, that's impressive, isn't it? 